Once a gas cylinder is in place, it's safe to unscrew the cap, but you should never force a cap off with a screwdriver or pry bar. That could accidentally open the valve or damage it. There are two valve components that are critical for a safe hookup. The first is a regulator, which controls how fast the gas can flow out of a cylinder. This device reduces the delivery pressure to a level that's safe and practical for the user at the other end. The second component is a CGA fitting, CGA for short, which connects the regulator to the cylinder. In most cases, the CGA is attached to the regulator permanently. The purpose of a CGA is to make sure that the gas in a cylinder is the right one for the system it is being hooked up to. So design details of CGAs will vary depending on the type of gas in the cylinder. Some CGAs are larger than others. Some have washers, some have notches, and they may have right or left hand threads. Each design matches a specific gas to its appropriate delivery system. When a CGA doesn't fit easily onto a cylinder's valve, there's probably a reason for it. That's why you should never attempt to connect them by force. That stubborn CGA is actually preventing something bad from happening. There's another safety fitting on most valves you should know about, and it's actually intended to leak under certain circumstances. It's called a pressure relief device, or PRD. If the pressure in a cylinder gets dangerously high, the PRD opens and vents off some of the gas, reducing the pressure and preventing a potential explosion. For instance, if a fire breaks out in a facility, the cylinders there can heat up. When the pressure inside them builds, relief devices will open and allow it to bleed off safely. This means that firefighters can enter the facility to battle the blaze without fear of encountering exploding cylinders. Of course, if the gas inside the cylinders are flammable, the release will only add fuel to the fire. But it's still preferable to having the cylinder explode. On the other hand, you won't find PRDs on cylinders that contain toxic or poisonous substances. Any escape of these gases is considered too dangerous to risk and even more dangerous than the possibility of the cylinder exploding.